Now, uh, the woman reported to the 37 military hospital with her husband, and this particular issue is with respect to the latest case of the death recorded as a result of the coronavirus outbreak. If you did not know, now we have three death cases as a result of the coronavirus outbreak. Now, this woman recorded abnormally high temperature and was detained. Now, the couple are set to be between 70 and 75 years. Uh, the couple has also, we, we, we understand, they do not have any travel record since the outbreak of COVID-19. However, suspicions point to a parcel they received some days ago. Now, a retired Major General, the woman's sample, we understand, was taken to Noguchi Memorial Institute for medical research on Friday. Now, the results were received on Saturday and she tested positive. She passed away on Wednesday, that's today. So our sources point to the fact that the husband uh, has also been tested and he is negative and has been discharged. So this is the details of the new case, uh, the death case recorded um, in the country. So now uh, we have three uh, cases of death. Now, and the details of the identity of the third person who died, uh, that's in the early hours of uh, uh, today, is what we've just given to you at a 37 military hospital. And what we, we understand is that this person did not have any travel record now and that could obviously mean uh, another situation and this uh, what you see right now on your screens is the global picture with respect to the coronavirus outbreak 458,662 cases as at some 15 minutes ago the deaths 20,799 those who have recovered it's a 113,776 now with respect to what's happening, uh, the WHO is saying that 85% of new uh, cases are in Europe and the U.S. And although this is what the WHO is saying, Donald Trump is very confident that by Easter, which is just about three weeks away, the U.S. may be able to open up parts of the country that were locked down. This is the Ghana situation. Total cases, 68, deaths, 3. This is what we do know as at um, uh, the, this time, the 25th of March today, 68 cases, 3 deaths recorded as we speak. This is what the situation is. And what that means is that over the last 8 to 9 days gone by, we'll keep recording cases on a daily basis. Now, this particular 68 is made up of 38 of this 68 are persons who are on the mandatory quarantine. So that's a place to watch. 